What's up, everybody? This is your boy, AC, and welcome to another edition of LA Sports Live. Now, as you guys are coming into the video, do me a quick favor. Go ahead and hit that like button. And if you're not already a subscriber, hit the subscribe button and make sure you hit that notification bell so you'll be notified via YouTube every time I drop a video. Now, with that being said, let's get down to business. Now, we, we have some breaking news coming out of L.A. Clipper camp. Now, of course, as you know, guys, I'm a Laker fan, but I'm going a, I'm to a try to be objective and not be biased. So here, here goes the story for the Clippers. Anyhow, they apparently this past Thursday, they, they brought in Joe Kim Noah, NBA veteran, for a, a workout. Now, the Clippers are viewed by many people, not by me, <laughs> but they're viewed by many people as uh, one of the comp one of the favorites to come out of the Western Conference this year. Of course, with their um, with their acquisition of Kawhi and PG, um, you know they're looked at as one of the favorites to come out of the West and possibly win the NBA title. So, looking at their roster, um, it it appears to be a pretty pretty solid roster pretty deep at every position with the exception of center now you guys know the clippers have big men um uh, six year man of the year, six year six man of the year candidate matres harold and uh they have a ivatsa zubak you know former laker as their two big men on the roster i think they also bought in another young player patterson but he's not really your traditional big man so uh, uh, apparently Clippers management was thinking they may be lacking a little bit size. So they bought uh, Joe, Joe Kim in for a workout. Now, as of yet, I haven't heard any news as far as whether they were going to sign him or not. Just that they brought him in for a workout. Um, what could he possibly bring to the Clippers? Well, you know, even at this point in his career, uh, Joe Kim is still a fairly decent um, one on one defender. And uh, it's still a better, better than average rebounder. So, again, I guess they're looking to bring somebody in to fulfill those traditional um, big man roles. Now, as you guys know, with the acquisition of uh, Paul George and Kawhi, you know the Clippers are they have they they have legit title uh, aspirations. Will that happen? Time will tell. Time for the outro. I'm out of here. <laughs> 